Um, I'm just, I'm just telling, explaining to Felix there. There's uh, motion sensors in here, and the last time I saw Sheila came up, we were, um, we were stopped by a security guard, and he tried to stop us from coming, from going up to the, trying to go up to the graves. They're not our graves, by the way. They're sisters. They're the nuns' graves. We were looking for the women's graves. Mm -hmm. They're behind the big prison wall, next to the prison wall. Even in death, they're not recognised. And he was Eastern European, and he told me his name. And uh, I said, you know, I said, this, I said, is the Auschwitz of Ireland. And he, he kind of looked at me strange. And I said, yeah, I said, this is where one of the places, I said. I said, all these institutions, I said, have uh, marked graves in them, I said. And nobody, I said, is doing anything about it except us, I said, the survivors. The government isn't listening to us, I said. I said, we, and I said, we are coming up here, I said, to make sure, I said, that we find that, that those graves. I told him, under no circumstances was he going to stop us. Then he said he was going to call the guards. I said, call the guards. I said, I'm not doing any criminal damage. I'm here, I said, to see, I said, the graves, I said. And to find, I said, to remember the women and children that came through those gates and never came out. He walked away and he left us. But all of this, all of it, is up for redevelopment. My concern is what they'll find underneath us. It. The secret graves. Yeah. In which it could and be hundreds, if not thousands, death, of women and children. In death, they're not even recognised. There's a big unmarked grave up against the prison wall. They say there's three to six hundred above there. They don't even have a headstone on their plot. I, what I mean by a headstone <laughs> is a marking of. Here lies, <coughs> here lies Mary. She died on such and such a day. I'm not on about, I'm not on about religion here. I'm about remembering somebody who died, whether it be a woman or child. So this is, with long, with, with plenty more of them. It's, it's We're our going there past. now to have a look. This, this is this is the past Ireland has to has to, has to face up. Yeah, it has to be remembered and it has to be, there has to be archives, there has to be interactive museums. And accountability. And, it has to be and accountability. And accountability because, I mean, even in death, I mean, we have to, we have to, we have to highlight it. We have to argue with, with, with departments within our own government. What about the human rights of these women and children? What about the human rights of all the women and children over to all the, the schools and the institutions? You stripped a woman of her basic right. You took away a child's name and gave him another name and another date of birth. You took their human right of being existing in this world. And even in death, you're taking away their human right because they're not being remembered. And ill-treated them. Yeah, and it was truly, and it's both church and state that are accountable.